is going on, my fellow gamers? Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead 2. Last episode, we lost my prized horse because a train ran over it. I'm still in shock and grief about my horse, but we did get I did get a new one. And I'm getting like one of the best horses that St. Dennis has to offer. There's my horse. Okay. It's really fast, really stamina based. Right. So we're gonna work on his these. handling in a minute. Thanks. But we're back in roads because we all know my favorite thing to do in roads is one thing and one thing only. And that is to see if we can rob people. Foxhound's just chasing me. So, there's two people here. Gonna need all your money, my friend. Or you got a big problem. I can't tr Shut up. What's going on? No. Hurry up. For the love of God. Stay back! Stay back, I say! Oh, shut. Got it? Oh, no. Is he one more, I think? Of... Which I drop 47% right now, which is awesome. We have to complete a single bandit challenge. We need one more person to hold up, so... Maybe we'll get one more person to be. Right, he has like a whole heart of people over there. You see that? I don't see that one other person. Come on. Yeah, my horse. Stupid mutt. Arthur, you fix right now. Hey, boy. You better pat that puppy. We need to pander him, so. Alright, I'm all happy. You dub Arthur for having faith in puppies again. Alright. Now, we need to find one person to come here who isn't afraid of being robbed. I don't care how much the robbery's for, I just want to rob them. So let's move around the road real quick, see if we get any luck. people there that wouldn't end well hmm. random house anybody around it they wants to lose their money we're here to see a hanging you know that someone's getting hanged rip them is a proud Upstand and perish. Nothing. Come on. There's got to be one person who will come to the church to get robbed. Churches are known for, right? Right? Oh. Right, I have an idea. Mister, give me everything you got. Shit, I ain't getting free. Now, come on. I got but two coins to rub together. You gonna take them? You test me. I got nothing but this. This it? Fine, just. All right, run away. 
Mission accomplished. Rob any two coaches? Okay, that doesn't sound too hard. But Alright, boy. Come on, my horse, we're gonna go visit the gang. Why is your name so generic? I was hoping you'd get an original name. Do we need to rob, uh, rob two stagecoaches? That doesn't sound too bad. I'm looking for my friend. Gavin. Weren't you in Den Denise? Yeah. Who knows? Alright, so we'll just go straight to our... Uh, Friends here and see if we can get lucky and get a stagecoach or two. Oh, you're freaking kidding me. Hey, you! Stop! Coach, go! Ah. Well, that did. That did not work as planned yeah. at all. What's the point of that, Arthur? Come on, man. Well, I could return that coach, but we're way too far away to return the coach. So let's, uh... The very best mission, because we haven't... Uh, you want to rob something? We've robbed everything. I don't need to rob stuff. I need to get. So it's a city bank, and then we're off. It's what you wanted. It's what we need. If we can manage it. City banks are hard, but we got a lot of guns. You think we can do it? Hey, can this wait? I'm kind of busy right now. Yes, I guess so. I'm, a, I'm a here for Mary Beth. I'm not here for you. Hello, Mary Beth. Oh, how are you, Arthur? Fine. How are you? Um, well, I'm well, I think. It's been quite a run we've had, but, but we're still alive. Mm -hmm. So, no regrets? Regrets for what? Well, for joining this band of maniacs. If you're a girl without means in this world, life is very scary. You boys care for me before no one cared for me. Well, life weren't very nice, Arthur. Not after Mama got typhoid, and that was a long time ago. Sure. What about you? <clears throat> I heard you ran into that Mary girl. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And? You got me thinking how that all ended. Long time ago now. What happened? <laughs> well, she didn't love me enough, I guess. Or I wouldn't change. Huh. 
Well, she was a fool then, Arthur. Well, she put a lot of good years in on an outlaw. She definitely was a fool. In these books, life seems so simple, but in reality, I, I can't make head nor tail of it. Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan, we have a problem. A real problem. It's Tilly. What? She's oh. been taken by them Foreman brothers she used to run with. Come along! The Foreman brothers? What are they doing here? Well, I don't know what they've been doing here, but I can tell you what they're going to be doing here. Dying. Sure. Do we need more guns? You and I can handle this, Arthur. Hmm? Where are we heading? I'll tell you on the way. Just get going. All right, we have the, uh, the brothel leader on All our right. side. Head for Rhodes. Head for Rhodes? She's in Rhodes? No. She's at a place called Bradley's house, just west of there. How do you know? When we first got here, she told me she was worried that our camp was near a safe house that gang she ran with used from time to time. And you told Dutch? No. She spoke to me in confidence. I suppose I didn't think it would be a problem. And now it is. Oh, yes. Well, what do they want with her anyway? I think I saw one of the foremans hassling her in Valentine. Yes. They probably followed us down here. You don't know what happened? She killed one of them, for good reason, but clearly they don't see it that way. Tilly? Yes. Young Tilly Jackson isn't as sweet and innocent as you might think. But like I say, she was defending herself. She fled, fell in... Hey! But like I say, she was defending herself. She fled and fell in with us right after that. I just hope we can get to her in time. It's not too far. If they touched a single hair on that girl's head, I will eviscerate the sons of bitches. Eviscerate? That's really? a big word. You do care, Miss Grimshaw. Of course I care. About all of you fools. Some just require a firmer hand than others. You were special. Thank you. Anyway, talking to folks disappear. Have you seen that boy Kieran since the party for Jack? Okay, I think that's the place up ahead. I think there's a guard. I'll deal with him. Whoa. Kind sir, we're lost and in need of some help. Now get out of here. Oh, I see that kindly face of yours, and I know that for the right inducement, a gentleman such as yourself could be mighty kind. Now get out of here. Oh, now you keep saying that. But you don't mean nothing by I it. I said... You said your last word. Now, what are you waiting for? Get in there and find our girl. Oh, yeah, do we'll shot on him. Now we're gonna go save her, chick. Let's do it. What the hell? Go find her before they put a bullet in her head. What the hell you think you're doing? Okay, Miss Tilly. Mm -hmm. Now, let's get you out of here. I thought there was... I... Yeah, it don't matter what you thought. It's okay. All right, let's go. Oh, come along, miss. Thank you, both of you. What happened? It was Anthony Foreman. He thinks he owns me. I remember. Where is he? He went out hunting or something. There were five of them, I think. Well, we killed those fellas there. There they are. Come on. Tilly, grab that gun. Anyone approaches, shoot them. Oh, don't worry. I'll be just fine. Now catch that uh, bastard. Uh, the one in front of the mall. Hey, another horse oh, thing. All right. Get after them. There. Straight ahead. I saw them go through those bushes. Oh, uh, my God. How did you survive this long? Damn it. They're heading down the hill to the water, and there they are by the shoreline. We're coming for you, you bastards! Good shot. All right, let's do it. Find the other guy. I think that 
That last one's the boss. Lasso him and we'll take him back to Tilly. Don't let him get away. Yeah. Don't kill him yet. I want Tilly to have the last word on this bastard. Bastard. You're making a big mistake. Come here. That's it. Now make sure you tie him up real good. Greg. Bring that bastard back to me. Uh, I'm gonna head over there now to check she's okay. With pleasure. Uh, I'll take his horse. He won't be needing it no more. <laughs> Sorry, horsey. This could get better. That's kind of strange, so... Do you have the you first idea what you're getting into? I'm Anthony Foreman. Well, thanks for the introduction, Anthony. Is that Foreman with an A? I want the Undertaker to spell it right. Funny bastard. <laughs> Who are you running with? She didn't tell you? She didn't tell me nothing. Oh, this rope is cutting into me. Don't feel so good when you're the one tied up, does it? She killed my goddamn cousin. Oh, don't worry. You'll be seeing him soon enough. What are you gonna do with me? I ain't sure yet. Reckon I'll let Tilly decide what you deserve. You're wasting your time with that girl. She's a liar. She'll screw you over like she did me. I should have shot the bitch yesterday yeah, like coward. a bastard. I should have shot the bitch yesterday. Delivery! Here's your man. Bring him here. Dump him on the ground here. I want to get a good look at this monster. So he's still alive then? Ah. I guess. You see this girl? You leave her alone. She killed my cousin. Your goddamn cousin had it coming, Anthony Foreman. I don't care if she shot your daddy and cooked your mama for breakfast. She's mine. She ate yours. You know, a friend of mine, he always says, <clears throat> revenge is a fool's game. Now, you want all your boys dead? She had her reasons. We was family, Tilly Jackson. You foreman boys ain't no kind of family I want. Kill him, Arthur! You want that? I want him to go away and tell the remaining of his cousins and the clowns he rides with to leave me alone! Now, you think you can do that, Anthony? Or should I... Slit your throat and just save us all the bother. I'll leave you alone. History is done. History is never done. It's your call, Arthur. But I'd slit his throat. Go on. You know, I'm gonna spare you. Uh, yeah. Let's get you home. <laughs> now get out of here. Usually I don't spare anybody, but I feel like that time that would be the right call. Not again. The horse. The horse all the way. Damn that horse! Wow. Okay, game. Come on. Oh, now. I have this horse now. And that's what we'll do. That was a really short mission. I still need to find one more freaking rabbit. Now I'm thinking about it. Uh, maybe eventually. I like this horse. Pretty quick. Come on. Hey, over here, over here. Eh. You're going to scam a horse.
Now let's do the other mission since that one didn't take as long as expected at all. Oh, does one take 30 minutes? Who goes there? It's me! Welcome back. Well, we have two people here we can do missions for. We have LA and SA. LA is, uh. What do we have? SA is a new mission. Sadie, or we can do Leopold Strauss. Oh, God. I'm doing SA. Screw Leopold Strauss. How you doing, Mrs. Adler? How are you? Been quite a journey since I. Well, since I joined you fellas. Yes. And now you and Dutch have joined high society. My oh, lord above. Yeah, it seems so. I think my days in polite society are over. Well, I just saw Bill Williamson at a party at the San Denise's mayor's house. <laughs> if he can do it, anyone can. You get any leads? Yeah, I think so. You know so, Arthur Morgan. Come on. We need to talk. Uh-oh. Miss Sadler, will you excuse us? When are you gonna let me come Robin with you, Dutch? My lord, a few more like her, we could take over the whole world. Yeah. A few more like her, there wouldn't be much of a world left. Yes, perhaps. Now, the trolley bus station. I went down there. I took a look at it. I think we can hit it. <laughs> I ain't never robbed in a city before. Yeah, well, you leave the planning to me. You'll ride with me. Always. Is it just you and me? No, we'll need one more, I reckon. I say Lenny. Not Micah. Well, that depends if you want a massacre or a payday. No, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Well, that's easy. Make them change. Very funny. <laughs> what is that? What? What the hell have they done to me? Look, they're in the tree line. Everybody take cover! Or Crystal Moore is What the freak? Mentioned that Holy slightly damn, before, What's but Get up there. hold in here. Stay away from the window. Holy cow! Get inside, fast! Come on, quick! Don't let anyone back through that door. Oh, I do want revenge on Transport. Okay. Find us. Arthur, you take the windows in the back. Go. Is everyone accounted for? I think. Hey, I said, is everyone accounted for? I think. You cornered now. I lost two people so far in our range. Help! Cover me! I just phoned me one of their women! Ah! 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 Ah!
This is my favorite woman here at the uh, Citadel. Why didn't you get inside? I miss all this. Come on, Arthur. Now we go back. We need you in the house, Mrs. Adler. Oh, 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 oh. Okay? I think so. Except for Karen here. Uh, poor kid. Mr. Swanson, could you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the body. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw. Already taking care of it. Come on now, work. Como Driscoll. That man can really hate. So can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. Away from here. So we should start looking for another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. I'm not sure I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. Wait, we're still gonna we hit the work. freaking trolley after that? Shall we? Yep. That'd be crazy to do that. God. What's that losing people? We didn't it's not even been a whole bunch of the last one. That poor kid we spared from O'Driscoll's gang up in the mountains is dead. They chopped his head off. Tried to kill a lot of us. The whole place gives me the creeps. Oh. Guys, next time on Red Dead Redemption 2, we hit a trolley. Today we're going to end on, what, 40, 48? I'll take 48. 48.7, I'll see you then.